Hello friends and welcome to YouTube channel Freedom Tech and in this session what we are going to learn. In this session I will share with you how we can use Agentic AI with Agno platform. Simple. So we will use Agno for agent. We will create the agent with the help of Agno and we will use Google Gemini Gen AI. Simple for vision. So before we move to our practical friends, if you learn something from our videos, please consider to subscribe our channel. Okay friends, thank you so much and let's get started. So friends, as I mentioned, today we will use Agno, as you can see the Agno, it is just like a lang chain or lang flow, simple. So with the help of Agno, we are going to create agent. And we will use the model we will use which is Gemini. Simple. So Agno, I will mention the link. Here you will get all the information. The models, as you can see, we have here various models, which is the open AI, then we have here a, a deep seek model, then grok model, and the model which we will use, which is the Gemini. Simple, you can use any model. So I will mention the link. You can simply visit the link and you will get the code also if you go here in examples we have here lots of examples simple as you can see if you click on the examples you will get the basic code uh, youtube agent is there research agent is there there is a lot of agent code ready to use so i will mention the link that's it but as i mentioned we will create here agent which basically we will use for vision so for that i have created new repository i will mention the link simply copy paste the link inside web browser then as we always do go to the code click on download zip and it will download our zip format repository so we downloaded our repository let's just open downloads so this is what our repository right click and then click on extra call click on extract it will extract our repository done so this is what our repository first we will download our video file so vid.txt copy the link open web browser open new tab control plus v hit enter it will open our mega cloud link where we have our video file click on download and it will uh, it will download our video file so meanwhile what we will do we will simply grab our api key so ai.google.dev go to the solutions gmini api and get gmini api key here i have already created one api key i will simply remove create api key and select any of your old project click on get api key click on copy and we have here my text file which i have created so this is what the text file let's just paste it so this is what our api key that's it now uh, we are downloading our video file it is a uh, 96 percentage done so meanwhile what we will do as you can see our video file is already downloaded now so let's go to the downloads cost.mp4 cut it and then we will move the video file inside our repository so we have our uh, video file also now first we need the packages so just open tony python id go to the tools manage packages so the first package is agno agno hit enter agno first package click on agno as you can see which i have already installed just click on install button then it will install agno then because we will use google gemini so we need google google hyphen gen ai gen ai hit enter google hyphen gen ai click on install button done it will install google gen ai simple that's it and then uh, because we will use here our usb web camera for live detection so we need open cv hyphen python open cv hyphen python first package click on install button done it will install OpenCV hyphen python so we need agno then we need a uh, google gen ai and then we need OpenCV hyphen python that's it done 
so now simply we will use our simple basic agent so test.py so friends this is what our test.py where we can use a gemini model which is the gemini 2.0 flash there is no need to mention exp so gemini 2.0 hyphen flash this is what the latest model and then uh, here we want to mention the api key so we copy our api key copy paste okay so let's just paste it done and then simply we can ask any question so let's just run the code what is ai it will search and then it will mention the response as you can see this is what the response artificial intelligence ai this is what our response so this is what our basic ai agent where we are going to ask any question now we will use gemini 2.0 and the agno for object detection using image so file open then uh, test 1.py where we are going to pass image and this agent will the agent will basically act as a image or uh, image to text or we can say from image it will mention it will describe what basically we have inside the image that's it or in uh, simple language we can say the object detection so here uh, again we want to mention our api key copy it and then just paste it now here uh, we have image which is uh, i have mentioned inside the repository let me show you as dot jpg as you can see this is what our uh, this is what our image simple so let's just run the code and here it is as you can see i have mentioned the instructions you are an ai agent that can generate the text descriptions based on an image you have to return a text response describing the image and what is in image give me details give me company name because inside the image if you open the image inside the image as you can see we have truck and we have a uh, we have basically bulldozer or we can say the construction side vehicles do we have basically here simple so let's just run the code uh, i have mentioned the image let's just save it and run the code so here it is as you can see the response so response is basically what the image shows construction site with white cf truck and yellow bulldozer the bulldozer appears to be a loading material into the truck the truck is parked on dirt road the bulldozer uh, has the number 40 on its side then in uh, background there is a rocky uh, slip and some trees under a partial the truck company name is basically the dap the main thing is what the truck company name is basically the dap so th this is the agent for image to text image to text and the instructions is basically how do we want our agent act what is our priority simple so this is what my priority so uh, in simple language we can say this is basically the prompt this is basically the prompt and this is my question this is my question so what i want or to ask for agent simple as simple as so first we create our normal agent using agno using agno and our gemini so we we create a normal agent where we can ask any question then we have our image to text agent means in simple language we can detect the object from this agent and now we will use our next agent and test3.py this is the agent for video to object means video to text what basically we have in video file so let me open the video file first in our uh, downloads we have our repository we downloaded our video file so this is what the video file which we downloaded as you can see we have here 1 2 3 4 the four excavator this is the uh, construction site we uh, site we can say simple so this video file we will pass inside our 
python code so here as you can see i have already mentioned the video file and tell me about this video it will describe what basically we have in our video file so here we want to mention our api key so copy it and just paste it done let's just save the code let's just run the code it will observe the video and it will describe the video means what basically we have inside the video file so friends as you can see here is the uh, description of the video the video shows an active construction site with multiple excavators working equipment several excavators are visible including green Kobleko, then yellow cat, the red Tata Hitachi, yellow Sani excavator. So if you open the video file, so uh, you will see that we have all these companies over here. As you can see, we have Kobleko, Tata Hitachi, cat and Sani. So it not just detected the object, it's also detected what is basically the object, the excavator and their company name using the new tool, which is the Agno. This is the tool as we use, uh, first we use a lang chain, but now this is a new tool which we can use with Gemini for object detection, for vision, Agno. Simple. So this is for the video file. So first normal agent, then uh, we use the agent for image to text. And then we use video to text and now we will use the agent with live webcam. So file open test fi uh, test 5.py and here again we want to mention our API key copy it just paste it. So this agent which I have mentioned the instruction is basically the prompt. What is my agent work or we can say how I want to agent react or how I want to agent work for me. So this is the instruction. So this agent is basically detect the helmet, safety jacket, gloves, boots and other protective gear. Simple. So here it is as you can see because we want to use the video camera. So for that we install CV2. That's it. So now it will start our web camera and then it will detect the object. So let's just start it. So as you can see friends, it started a web camera and here it is as you can see the helmet no, safety jacket no, gloves no, boots no. So now I have here a helmet, I will wear the helmet and then we can see what is the response, simple. So as you can see this is what the helmet and I have wear the helmet and then we will see safety jacket, helmet is yes, as you can see helmet is yes, safety jacket of course no, gloves no and boots no but helmet is yes. Now if I move the helmet, there will be uh, again helmet no, uh, jacket no, as you can see the helmet no, safety jacket no, gloves no, boots no. Simple. So this is how friends with the help of, with the help of Agno agent, Agno dot agent, you can use Gemini, you can use the Gemini for normal agent then for image to text then for video to text and then for the live usb web camera that's it so i have mentioned the full code for each agent if you want more i will mention the agno agent document link go there and use agno i hope you will learn something from this video we'll meet our next video till then thank you take care and bye bye